Hey guys, it's and Daniel. Take a look at this. I've made a new team for you guys, and this team is built around Inform Luis Suarez. We've got Royce, Sturridge, Ozil, etc. And we've got three amazing leagues in this team. We've got the Bundesliga, the BPL, and of course the Liga BBA. I went with the 3 5 2 formation. That's something new. I've never done that before, and this team gets 100 chemistry. But before I talk about the players, I'm going to tell you one thing real quick. And that's in links by FIFA Coins. Be sure to check out FIFA Coins online for a trusted, reliable source. Their Facebook page is in the descriptions below, so check them out and give them a like. In the goal, we've got a manual Neuer button. For 45,000 coins, 85 diving, 82 handling, 91 kicking, 87 reflex, 82 positioning, 6.4 feet tall, he's got 50 speed, and his save technique is traditional. And this guy's got to be one of the best goalkeepers in this game. And moving on to the defense. In the right center back position, we've got this guy, Inigo Martinez Beriti. He's got 77 pace, 80 defending, 59 passing, 79 heading, 5.11 feet tall, and a bottom for 600 coins. And then we've got the man himself, Sergio Ramos, 80 pace, 72 dribbling, 84 defending, 86 heading, 74 passing, 3 subscribers. Almost three star big foot, six feet tall, 27,000 coins, and he's got high medium work rate. In the left center back position, we've got Jerome Boateng, 950 coins, 75 pace, 72 passing, 79 defending, and 82 heading, four star big foot, three star skill moves, and he's 6.4 feet tall. So he's pretty tall, and he's got amazing heading stats. I like that. And in the CDM positions, we've got Sami Kedira, 900 coins, 59 pace, 84 defending, 78 heading, 74 passing, 71 shooting, four star big foot, two star skill moves. But the only thing bad about this guy is his pace. It really shows in the game. He's just so slow in my opinion, but his defending stats make it up. And right beside him, we've got Javi Garcia. 63 pace, 67 shooting, 75 passing, 87 heading, 82 defending, 2 star skill moves, 3 star big foot, bottom with 750 coins, and he's 6.1 feet tall. So god damn it, this guy can head with the ball. That's just how it is. And moving on to the right mid, because there we've got a quick guy. His name is Jesus Navas. Jesus Christ is quick. 91 pace, 86 dribbling, 71 shooting, 79 passing, 4 star skill moves, 3 star big foot, bottom with 21,000 coins, 5.7 feet tall, and he's got high, medium, more great, decent player, amazing pace, and great skill moves. And moving on to the other wing, the left mid. There we've got Marco Royce. 91 pace, 86 shooting, 80 passing, 86 dribbling, 60 heading, 4 star skill moves, 4 star big foot, 5.11 feet tall, and a bottom for 78,000 coins. Hallelujah, Jesus Christ. In the center attacking mid position, we've got Mesut Ozil, 73,000 coins. What am I thinking? This team is so expensive, but let's do this. 76 pace, 74 shooting, 85 passing, 87 dribbling, 4 star skill moves, 2 star big foot, medium low work grade, 6 feet tall, 2 goals in 9 games, Jaisis. And on top, we've got two Liverpool players. Let's start off with Daniel Sturridge. 90 pace, 83 dribbling, 70 heading, 77 shooting, 65 passing, 4 star skill moves, a 3 star big foot, and a bottom for 8,500 coins. But to end off this team, we've got Luis Suarez in form, 82 pace, 87 shooting, 76 passing, 76 heading, 92 dribbling, 4 star skill moves, a 4 star big foot, high, medium, work rate, 5.11 feet tall, and a bottom for 289,000 coins. What am I thinking? God Damn it. Okay, guys, so this team has got a lot of strength, pace, skills, and some extremely expensive players. So we can kind of say that this episode is a test. We're testing out if the players are worth it or not. And you know what, guys? In this episode, I'm going to show you my first four games with this team. Will I lose? Will I win? Let's find out. And this is it, guys. My first game with this amazing team. We get matched up against this team. Alika BBVA side. Benzema up front. Diego Lopez in the goal. Ozil finds a Royce from the corner kick, a Royce, one touch, and the shot, 1-0, 1-0, that is just how I like it, Benzema here on the ball, gets a shot in, Vavela tries, no, but the defense is on the right, it plays at the right time, saves that, we hit the crossbar, can we make that 2-0, can we get that inside, Sturridge gets the ball again, but he misses once again, which is not good, Suarez here gets the ball somehow back, pretty lucky, 2-0, and that is how I like it. 2 0, easy peasy stuff. Wait a second, inside. Overhead kick. Oh, no, no, no. That's pretty unlucky. Second half, he gets a chip. What was Neuer doing? He just ran out like a fool. But we look at that. Now he's. Uh, and we hit the crossbar. Why can't we just get a goal again? Why not? Wait a second, now we hit the post. Jesus Christ. But we win the first game of this episode, and things are looking pretty goddamn amazing. Alrighty then, game numero dos, and we get matched up against the BPL squad. That is nothing new. Check in the goal. I think it's gonna be amazing. We get the free kick here. He just catches the ball. He's got that. 
He's gonna jib it. Oh my god, that's unlucky. But he's gonna do it again. Why am I always going out with the goalkeeper? Neuer, Neuer, Neuer. That's my fault though. Royce here tries to get back into the game, which is just not... Look at that. Look at that nonsense. The beginning of the second half was dreadful. But, you know, we tried to get back into the game. Here we go. He's 2-0 up. You know, I was just trying to make something sexy for you guys. Look at that. Over a kick. And here we go, another over a kick. He's gonna save that, and again we're gonna save. You know, this was a dreadful, but we managed to get one goal back, and that is of course in form of Luis Suarez. And look at that. What is gonna happen here? What is gonna happen here? The game is gonna end, and we're gonna lose our first game with this team. Game number two is a loss, and I'm not happy about that. Not at all. Uh, oh well, one win, one loss so far. In the third game of this episode, we get mad stop against yet another BPL squad. Checking the goal, Samuel Edso up front. We're gonna start this out with this bang! Kajira unlucky, but Sturridge, what can Sturridge do? He's gonna hit the crossbar, Luis Suarez, come on, no! What is going on? No, that is not good. Wait, a second one, a save from Neuer, though. Jesus Christ, Royce with cuts inside, and the finesse, 1-0. That is a brilliant, right before the halftime whistle. No, 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 that's not right before, because he's gonna do that. A bit sweaty, 1-1, can't blame him. He wanted to get back into the game, and he deserved that. It was pretty good, but Luis Suarez got a bit aggressive, got a yellow card for that. Boa Tang, 70 minutes gone, and we get the lead again, which I loved. But then this year happened. Jesus Christ, what a wally! That is Hernandez, 2-2. And this year, what is going on? This is extra time, and I get the lead. Oh my god, that was disgusting. But we won our second game in this episode, so now we've got two wins and one loss, one game remaining. How will that game end? Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Two wins, one loss, and now we get matched up against yet another BPL squad. Is this a joke? No, it's not. Sturridge it cuts inside somehow. That is beautiful. 18 minutes gone, and we get the lead. He doesn't want to celebrate. I don't know why, but Jovicic again, once again, I do the same mistake. Neuer goes out. We do an optimistic over a kick. Luis Suarez on the free kick. That is just how it's done. Informed Luis Suarez really knows how to kick the ball. And Villian does know. Oh my goodness. Christ Lord. What in the name of God was that? We get a... Wait a second. Double over a kick inside the goal. Now that is offside. God dang it. Free kick. What? Who got the goal? Ursula? What the hell? 3-2. And uh, he's going to get a red card here. Let's end it up with that. Free kick from the right. Oh, what a save. Okay, guys. So this team won three games out of four. And I'm pretty happy about that. This team showed a character. Okay, guys. So now that I've used this team, I can give you my honest opinion about it. And you know what? I love this team, but I hate this formation. I'm never going to use it again. But guys, now I need your help. Let me know in the comment section below what team you think we should build next. Around what player, what team, what league. And of course, if you've liked this episode, be sure to hit that like button. Really means a lot to me. I appreciate your support. It's been me, Daniel. Have a nice day. Goodbye.